So now we're going to go over the speech feature of the Amplebox 260. The first thing that you want to do is make sure that you have the speech button pressed. It should turn green. Every time you go to use your speech at the beginning of the day, you should always check to make sure that your VU meter is set correctly. So I'm going to show you how to set your VU meter correctly for um, the mic. So if you're using um, your own voice to do the speech, I'll teach you how to do that first. So the first thing you want to do is check out the level dB, that's where your VU meter is. And to increase the level for the VU meter, you are going to just press the masking buttons. So right now we can see that my voice is not meeting up to the 0 dB level. So now I'm just going to increase it until we do. And to do that, I'm just going to say, say the word, say the word, say the word say the word, say the word. So I'm at about 11 dB and now my voice is able to meet it. So hot dog, cowboy, ice cream. So now my voice is, is peaking at zero dB. So if you are using a sound booth with this device, and you are doing speech testing and you have a headphone like this, you can press the talk over and they can hear you through the mic. And then if you don't have a headphone set like this, you can still communicate with your patient because there is a built-in microphone. And so again, you would just press talk over and they should be able to hear you. If you have a CD player, the way that you would do it is for speech, you would press the button again and you would see the screen line, dash mic, monitor, and level. That's when you know that you're ready to use your CD player, which is the suggested way of being able to do it. Recorded speech is always going to be better than your own voice. So now we're going to go ahead and press the play button. And usually the CDs will start out with a calibration tone. And so now I'm just going to increase the level until I get to zero dB.